A good evening. Still a couple of very light showers out there, maybe even sprinkles. Otherwise, we are drying things out after some uh, heavier downpours slid on through a few showers to the west of us. A few showers now in Martinsville. Again, this is very, very light stuff crossing the area as we speak. The thunderstorm activity from this afternoon really winding down and has been over the past couple of hours. That'll revamp again tomorrow afternoon. We're looking towards the morning hours uh, just after the morning commute. A few stray showers possible. I really think most of us wake up tomorrow on the drier side, the better chance for widespread thunderstorms and even the potential for some stronger storms come back into the picture tomorrow afternoon. Here we go at 11 o'clock again. A few stray storms right now. Look at that. Since we get towards the early part of the afternoon, we'll start to see the coverage expand and the intensity start to expand with these uh, scattered thunderstorms looking towards 5 to 7 o'clock. Notice again, still some scattered strong thunderstorms out there. Those darker reds and purples indicating where well, we're going to have the best chance for some heavier pockets of rain and also the potential for some very, very strong winds. We're keeping a close eye on that going forward as a strong cold front going across the area over the next 12 to 24 hours. Live look in Roanoke with our Carillion Skycam. It is cloudy. It is quiet right now. Temperature is in the mid 70s. Heat indices in the middle 70s too. It wasn't too terribly hot in terms of the temperature. We did not hit 90 today across the area, but the humidity was cranked up and that's something we're going to see tonight into tomorrow before some big time changes, almost fall like changes come down the pipeline heading into the upcoming weekend. Dew point temperatures settling in right around 70 degrees in Roanoke. Look at this middle 70s dew points not ahead of this front that comes by tomorrow. We are just going to pump right into all of that humidity and that's coming in this direction again. So another very humid day tomorrow. That is going to change though, so the humidity not going to last much longer. We do have that big time cold front now again along this cold front tomorrow. That's going to be the focal point for thunderstorm development and a few of those storms could be on the strong to severe side. But behind this front heading into the weekend, especially Saturday afternoon and then once we get into Sunday, big chunk of Canadian high pressure slides on in. That's going to deliver us much cooler air, much more refreshing air. In terms of the dew point though tomorrow, again, still hanging out in that uncomfortable category. Dew point temperature is in the low, possibly even middle 70s. So I think some of us, especially across south side, going to be and that oppressive category, but we all head back to that comfort area once we get into Saturday afternoon, especially the evening and overnight. And then once we get into Sunday, forget about it. Uh, great window opening weather really for the second half of the weekend. Give the AC a break for a change tonight. Again, a few lingering showers. Otherwise, though, we got partly cloudy. A few areas of fog tomorrow morning, especially the areas that saw the heaviest rain tonight. So just be on the lookout for that during your morning commute. Heading into tomorrow again, a few scattered showers and thunderstorms. Temperatures hanging out in the lower 80s across the Roanoke Valley, middle 80s across south side tomorrow for your three degree guarantee for tomorrow. We are 81 again. Look at that weekend Saturday back to the mid 70s, 80 degrees on Sunday. And again, the humidity pretty much non-existent for the second half of the weekend. Overnight lows in the 60s, even some of us into the upper 50s. Sunshine back with us for the better part of the upcoming work week. Three degree guarantee for today. 88 to forecast. Mm. 87 was the high. We can throw in 10 bucks in the pot, though. $620 for the month. Guys. Hey, 